welcome back to another YouTube with the Campbell County Public Library. Today, we're going to be doing YouTube Valentine's Day Science, and I'm Miss Brittany. I'm the Children's Programmer at the Cold Spring Branch. We're going to use some common household items, such as vinegar and baking soda with water. And for Valentine's Day, we are going to use the conversation hearts. This is what they look like. All right, so let's go ahead and get ready and dive on in. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna to wanna to start with is a glass about almost halfway full. I suggest a big glass because I did this with a simple 16 ounce cup and I had like an eruption from the baking soda and the vinegar mixing um, and I made a huge mess. So my best advice is to one, do this somewhere where it's okay to make a mess. Uh, two, have towels just in case. Three, use a really big container, preferably glass so you can see the reaction. But we're gonna get started. So we have our container of water and what we need to do first is take our baking soda and you're gonna to wanna to use one tablespoon. Put that way so you can see. All right, so you take your tablespoon of baking soda and then we're just gonna put it in the water. Simple. Then we're gonna mix it up. give it about 15 seconds so it can kind of clear up. All right, so our baking soda is in it. We're gonna go ahead and grab our hearts. You can just grab a handful and then we're gonna put them in. So you'll already see that they sunk to the bottom. Now, what we're gonna do, and in order to make this reaction work, is we're gonna add vinegar. And this is going to be really fast. This is a super quick experiment. Now, what adding vinegar does is it eats at the candy coating, and then it starts pulling all of the carbon dioxide out. So that makes the candy hearts jump. And that's how we're gonna see this experiment. So I'm gonna put it closer. Oh, you can see it. And then I'm gonna add, maybe I'll hold it up. All right, you ready? So you see how they're starting to dance and jump? Maybe I'll add a little bit more. So now give it a second because all of them will start to jump up as soon as the vinegar settles. I don't know if you can, can you see it? They're starting to dance. <laughs> so this reaction will last for probably about three to five-ish minutes. Um, and you can just keep staring at them and watching them jump. Maybe you can try to do different experiments. Um, you know, maybe you only put one in and see what happens. Maybe you put more in and see what happens. Maybe you add more vinegar and see if that makes them dance even more. Like how much vinegar do you think you really need? What happens if you don't put a lot of vinegar into it, right? So this is just a really simple and fun experiment that you can do anytime at home. You can use as much candy hearts as you want. Um, it's just really super silly and super fun. Let's add a little bit more vinegar and see what happens. Ooh, see now it's all going back to the bottom. But there they go. Maybe I had too much vinegar. Who knows? 
let's see what happens if we put a little bit more baking soda into it, right? Let's see. Oh, that's where we make messes. And now you know. Baking soda makes a lot of mess. But look at them go. They're dancing even more. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed doing this experiment with me. Uh, have a fantastic day. Enjoy the snow. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.